point. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to bypass iOS 7.0 and 7.0.2. So Apple recently update on iOS 7.2. They updated from 7.0 7.2. So yeah, because they had a bug on their thing, like you know. So yeah, I'm going to show you guys on both 7.0 7.2. This device is on iOS 7.0. I didn't update it yet, so I'm gonna show you on both of the 7.0. Okay, so the first thing you're gonna do is oh, slide up. Okay, then what you're gonna do is hit the clock right there. Right there, hit the clock right here. Then hold down the power button. Hold it down. Okay. Press cancel, then hit two times on the home button as fast as you can. See, it should bring you to the multitasking. So this is the first one, iOS 7.0. iOS 7.0. So next, I'm gonna show you iOS 7.2. So this device is on iOS 7.2. So I'm gonna show you how to bypass that right now. So for it works on iPhone 4s, 5, 5c, 5s, any device. It was iOS. So yeah. So basically, what you're gonna do is if it, if you have iPhone 4, this is iPhone 4 by the way. If you have iPhone 4S, you're going to do the same step, but in a different way, though, like, yeah. So, the whole other power button, what's the Siri also? Call bypass iOS 7. Just tell this to Siri, and she will call it. Like, any fake number. Calling bypass iOS 7, home. Okay. Next step is going to be, like, super hard or super easy for you, I don't know. So you're gonna you hit FaceTime and hold on the power cards. button fast. Like and seriously, aspect. I'm gonna put this down. Hit FaceTime and hold on the power button real, real fast. Okay, now I'm, I'm gonna hit cancel. Phone hit time two times on the home button, and you're on the contacts and everything. See, you, you can like call anyone right now, anything. So yeah, guys, I like call anyone right now. See, I can call anybody from my contacts. My uncle, my dad, anyone. So, yeah. So, guys, that's about it. Thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please uh, subscribe, like, and comment. And peace out.